Okay, so hey you guys, I forgot to do my intro because I was waiting to get done with the makeup to show y'all, but I just totally forgot, so just, you know, this is the intro, so hey guys. Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. So today, well, okay, today, um, I got a little question and answers from my Instagram asking what kind of videos I would like to see next week. And a yes, lot of girls, a lot of girls was asking for a lot of girls to chat. Um, how to do my eyebrows. I'm gonna give that to you guys. So, it's gonna be a little lengthy video. Especially for my eyebrows. It takes me so to do my eyebrows. But, um, yeah, we're gonna get right into that. And I'm gonna show y'all the basics of like I did in the other video, but I'm gonna talk about it so we can go bad things. a lot of bad things. So this big old bag has all yeah. my makeup essentials in there. Like all of it. Just makeup essentials. And it's pretty full. But I keep my stuff that I use right here. So normally when I do my makeup, like if I'm not I'm like, you know, look good or like, you know, like, I feel 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 like, Outside you know, my eyebrows are so small. I make sure that no side and they're just a little thin little lines, but I love that about it because it's pretty good. A lot of bad and I'm gonna show me. I'm gonna show y'all show how I do my eyelashes. I would like to tell y'all more about my eyelashes too, where I'm getting from. I can drop the links if y'all want the Amazon links when I get them. So I just want to start off. Eyebrows, you know. So we're gonna start on my eyebrows next. You see me looking over here, I like straight up like this. I'm looking at two different mirrors. I like to have one close to my face, which is a double-sided one, so a regular on this side, magnifying on this side. <clears throat> Not that a lot of girls get this, especially for makeup for me, but hair for different. But I actually got this deep brow from I believe it was five and below. Cause they don't be having black dip brows. Like, they always have black brown. They never have black. I'm liking that. Like, I'm talking about brains, like part in it. And the stars, like, I never see them have black. But I see them do. So I was like, oh, yeah, this is what I need. Cause all my hair is they just thick and through the brown. I don't really like them. They just look stuff. They don't look real put together. Plus, my hair isn't dark brown on my face. So, what I normally like to do is try to match up my two brows right here because I don't know if you can tell one starts down here and the other one starts up here. They're not sisters or cousins. So, what I like to do for the most part is brush them out first. Then, after I brush them out, I um, line them up right here. And then we start. So, um, oh, I don't even know where my around is at. Shut up, Oh, it's in my purse. Hold on, guys. Okay. In my purse. So, I take this little eyebrow pencil that I have. <clears throat> I'm gonna use the blue side, you know, just brush my brows up and out. Up and out. Don't forget up and out because if they're not going up and like out like that, you know, it just goes like this. If you don't do up and out, it just goes like that. No, you wanna break them up. So you can 
I'm still waiting to know where it is. I can't 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 know where it is. Yeah, I definitely learned that from a YouTuber that does my book. Okay, come on. Shut up. I'm gonna follow Rodney. Do you know where your natural arch is? Um, this is kind of self-explanatory, so I guess I'll just talk to y'all while I'm doing this. How did you guys day been? Today it was well, it was supposed to. They said it was supposed to snow again. It didn't even snow, guys. It all it did was ice, and it wasn't even that much because it was still drivable. It was still able to drive when it wasn't like last time's so ice was bad. You was still able to drive, so the kids were school. Just for today, we still have it tomorrow. They should have just kept this out for tomorrow too. It doesn't make sense. And then it's like a late arrival. It doesn't even make sense at all. I don't do it. I really don't get this for a time. It doesn't make sense. Um, I just want to have a little talk. I've actually been really happy mentally. I'm just happy with life. I just survived and living, living life in the moment. I'm not stressing. Letting her come to me. I'm not really stressing. Now with this brow, I have to do it kind of downwards more when lining it so I can match up the two points right here. But they naturally arch up in the same area. They just don't start in the same area. So I always have to start it down here. Because my eyebrows are so different. And it'll look like it's over lines. That's okay. Because when you carve it out, it's just fine. Yeah, back to what I was saying. I've been happy, guys. You know? Just living life. Starting to go to the state school. Deal with the turf. And a lot of my friends on Instagram, a lot of y'all were saying that y'all was looking into doing it. And I really think you should. I mean, it's time for soon, but you're going to do what you want. That's going to make you, you know, how can I say this? You go for what you want to do in life. And if you want to do it, then you want to do it. Do, it. do research about it. If you don't know much about it, you look at YouTube videos, look at young people are doing it around you because not so many people you know are advertising that they are young and doing it and i will actually be having an upcoming you know youtube playlist just based on me doing my senior finishing out my senior year and also being in literature but um the asian school i will be putting that content out for sure and I also need to do a QA so you guys can get to know me better. So I don't need to do that. 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 So speaking of, I just want to give y'all a good little vlog so I can get to know me that way. I do need to do a QA for you guys so you can get to know me for sure. Now, I know it's the contractors. I know. But it's funny because I have to open on it at the bottom right here. So what I do right here, I just bring up right here like that, give it an ombre look, and then bring it down to and out this way. This is what I do just to get it from looking so dark up there because you want to turn ombre out into darker. So sometimes I have to overline just because they're so thin, but when I carve it all out, it's like perfect. But I just a tactic that I've learned on myself. I mean, not that many people use it, but I do because my eyebrows are so thin that it's kind of predictable. Some days they look good, some days easy. Um, yeah. I'm living like, um, really thriving out here. <clears throat> also, getting close to my, um, Getting close to the new month, March, and it's gonna be spring break, and a lot of the content will come out of spring break, you guys. A lot of good content. I'm not testing it. For sure. I wanna 
hope you guys enjoy the content. Please subscribe to me too. Whether it's clothing haul, shoe collection videos. Shut up, I'm gonna follow Robin. You know, just wanna. Just wanna get you guys excited now. <laughs> I look like the angry word boy. Do the red one with the brows. You know they will. Uh -uh. Um, this is the filler I use for my eyebrows and under my eye. But I also use Tarte, and this is the same color. I recently just got into Tarte, and I'm out of this color, and I need to get this color again. Because Tarte just got some good old concealer, and I just want to find a place with this. I always come up with this because this is what I started using when I first started doing makeup and it just worked so good. And I actually have two of them for the same color. Same exact color. And this color is Fawn. And for officially. So I just want to use that color and pick it up around the same colors as many people think I use the same color as me. I didn't get that. And I get a flat brush. I got these brushes off of Amazon. They were a gift to me by my dear mother. So I just tap a little bit off of the brush onto the of my hand. When doing makeup, it's like for doing art. Now you have your art palette, your hand is your art palette, so your hand is going to be messy. Just a second. Fine. Nothing to do with it. I'm going to be messy. Just tap this out. So when carving the brow, I'm going to throw it at the top. Really smooth, and I'm actually gonna try to let y'all see me do it so I'm not blocking my face that much. But I take it and I use the tip of the brush only, then I raise my eyebrow up so I can get all up in there right. I raise my eyebrow. <laughs> but I, I'm not new, new to make up like that. I know what I'm doing. Some of y'all can try. Let me know. And then at the top. Yeah. I know a lot of y'all be kissing it. At the top of your eyes, you're always kissing it. You're always kissing it. You're always kissing it. You're always kissing it. If you're gonna use the filler at the top of the brow when you're carving at the top, put your foundation over that so it doesn't show. 
hate a white cat. What the fuck? You don't want to have any girl. Doesn't look good. Doesn't look extra good. You see me doing it better on this side anyway. I hope that sometimes I won't like, I feel good sometimes I don't like I finesse down with the road like this. I go down to GOD. I go hard on South Side G. I make sure that no side E. If the foundation don't want to work with me that day, I'll take concealer and do that to top, and then I'll cover the concealer with the foundation because it's just better. Because concealer is quicker. You know, foundation is kind of sometimes my water is dry. So it's a water based concealer. I like the. The way your natural brow grows, I'm not going to try to push me. And just follow that all the way my hair grows. I'm going to be more rushed. If you can, you can get all right. Do you put brown on it? Make it look. Uh-uh. Okay, no, because I want to give y'all an example. Turn off this light. You see that? This is why you have to not just use the concealer, but also put your foundation over it. Because if you just leave it like this, it doesn't look right. Because you have foundation up here and then this color right here. And it just doesn't look right. So, just a tip on that. I just want to show you that. And actually, it looks better with the light. So y'all can see that. Shut um, up. I'm just take it all the way naturally in my hair, though. And I'll put it in here. And it looks nice. And it looks nice. Let's see how I get the tip in here. Yeah, 
kind of hard to do girl talk and also do my makeup because my eyebrows is the main part. So I can't even do that girl talk yet until I really get to the face. And that's gonna come up soon because it don't take me that much time. Oh. And this part really. I'll be talking about girl stuff real soon after I get done with my brows. Okay. I can with the hardest thing first and with the hardest thing. Hardest thing for me, eyebrow lashes. I don't know what it is about my lashes, but. And it's so frustrating at the end. I understand why we can't just all get along. We don't be in the middle of the room. We can't. We know how I like it when you love me. Okay. I don't want to talk for them to miss me. You got me. Yes, I see the thing. This is around the time that I'll go ahead and start priming my face while I'm doing like, the This priming is so good, like I told y'all in my last bit for the get ready with me. And this works really good. Like, my skin is sensitive, but it's also dry. It's like the worst combinations. Shut up, I'm gonna fall around you. I like the worst combinations. So, I just go ahead and I do drop right here, drag it down. Drop right here, drag it down. Drop right here, and especially on my nose, because my pores on my nose, they're always showing. And I get this front brush right here, and I just blend it out like this. So you guys, I've been really conflicting on like what hairstyle I should do next. I don't know if I want to go back to my short hair. I don't know if I want to keep playing with it and doing different styles more. I'm also going to take this. Shut up, I'm gonna 
hydrated and there's like a different angel. So, um, yeah, I've been kind of conflicting like, on when I take this down, I don't know, you know, what look is going to be next because I like to keep y'all on y'all toes. I don't post much on my skin. I'm always on my skin. It's just like, I like to keep y'all on y'all toes and what am I going to do next because I'm, I'm not a person that puts my business out here because I'm a very private person and I should do I like to have a silence. You know, what's going on in my life, and I'm not saying it. You know, to that many people, my people speak. So it's just like, I don't know if I want to keep continuing with Dre Styles. Because I think I'm going to do like, I've been seeing like people do, like people that are real Dre Hair girls. I love that. I'm going to make some inspiration. But um, I've been seeing a lot of them, like, they'll have dreads, but they'll like roll it up into a bob and it looks so cute. Like if I can find that picture of Callie with it, it looks so good on her. And I was just like, ooh, that is so cool. That's really different. Um, I'm just going to the same type of course, but it's going to be really different. And I'm just going to be okay, bro. mocha and it is to for like the dewy and smoothing out <clears throat> and then I go in with this real technique brush I got this from Ulta and I go in with this brush first so you can smooth it out more and I'm going to actually turn my light to the front and just a little dot on my face okay, like I'm going to start the motion to run with it <laughs> Okay, you know, just give it even, okay. Get above the lip, get above the lip. Put everything else out, get above the lip. And then you gotta run the lip, on your nose, and your bridges on the lip. And then you gotta run the lip, get your chin. I'm going to 
dark spots on my, on my face growing up i was a little tomboy so i was outside playing fighting like that so i naturally have scars and dark marks on my face from scars and crashes everywhere on my body really so i just sometimes like to cover those up a little bit more when i'm done with the foundation I like to go in with um, my concealer this. So I'll go in with my darker one first. This would be these two. But I'm using this as a substitute for my tart because I was. And I take my little flat brush again. I'm gonna take my little one this time. Take my little flat brush. Like and the way TikTok has influenced my life is crazy because I found a perfect way to do it like instead of without making it look all, uh, you know, catchy looking under the eyes. So you're doing it. You're lying down, out, 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 on, out, out, out. Don't bring it down so much. Keep it in this area. And then, you know, get your little lines over there. I don't know if I got that off there. I can't think of this one. Even if you're using the brushes on this thing, line, line, line. Out, out, out. Good line. On my chin, you see your highlight points. So you want to highlight those trees. So here we go. Your nose. Now, I blend this out with a real technique flat working brush. It looks like this. And I give it a little dent. So you can be able to move the product around. Have your little pet. Actually turn it right off so you can see better. And it might look crazy, but you just gotta trust the process in yourself. I like to get it on the side of my nose too. So, you know, have all the colors mixed up together. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
part of it. Boom. Now I'm gonna take the brush again first. And then corner of your eyes. Especially if you have bags. Get in the corner of your eye. It's okay. It's okay to cover up those bags. It's okay to get those bags. Get those bags, you know? But um, let's talk about more about my life. Because I basically already gave you a blueprint on how to do the custom lip part. So I'm going to have to talk about it down if it's me. stress on myself about something that you know is going to come full circle for me because I know that I got a good night to go that serves a good purpose and we always got all that and we have some too put it on my nose keep it going that long Thank you. 
I need to start playing a graduation outfit because they told us we can't even wear heels. We can't wear heels or platform shoes. So I just walk across the little field and some scenes. No heels? I think that's really pushing it. Like, I think I, I think they're really pushing it. No heels or platform type of sandals. Really, that's kind of overboard a little bit, a little tiny bit. Because what do you want us to wear? Just sandals? Mm. I just don't think that's right. I don't think that's fair at all. Let them girls work for it. They want to If they fall, shut up. I'm gonna fall. They don't pick the shoes they wear. That's not right. It's not right at all. But I'm now going in my concert and I'm going to get brush. I got to get my little brush. Then I take, I think like an eyeshadow brush. That's what it looks like. Right? Just looks like an eyeshadow brush. Shut up, I'm gonna follow Roddy. That's it for the nose area. Nose area. I've, I haven't blended out yet. So, yes, it's gonna look harsh. Then, for my cheeks area, I took this little brush right here. It's really powdery. I could really use it for a foundation or either contour. Shut up, I'm use these brushes for whatever you want to shut up. And I tap it, tap it. I kind of like, like this on my arm. I will win because it is like dark, so it's gonna be harsh. And just suck it in. better looking than the birthday pictures like the man that took my pictures he did not do good at all like i literally had like probably 20 pictures to choose from and i was in there and i took like about 40 pictures at each station i was at he was bad 10 out of 10 would not recommend him would not at all only if i knew that man name I would not recommend him to nobody. He did not know what he was doing. Okay. Now, I don't normally do powder unless I'm like doing something that I know is going to be sweaty. So I'm not going to show you that step. But naturally, when I would do powder, I'll show you the powder. Alright. So, this is the powder I use. And this part of the Fit Me collection. It's just, I don't know what it is about the Fit Me, but it just works good on my skin. That's that. So, now that I'm really done, I like to go ahead and set my face in there. Because this is basically it. I set my face in a little bit of setting spray. Use a lot. But, also, when you do a setting spray, I see it done. Don't move your face. Because when you move your face, it's the way it's going to crease up and that's the way it's going to stay. So, hold on. Thank you. 
Okay. And I'm done with that. I can continue talking. But yeah, the person that I did, he just did my pictures. Damn. My Kevin Gamp pictures are really pretty though. Um, they are. I'm not even gonna front my camera. He did good on those. I'm not gonna do with that. So I like to put on the Jewish palette. Palette. Eyeshadow palette. And I like to put in with this go right here. I put that on my finger. Down my nose. Down right here. And I take this oh, I take this little brush right here that I put everything out with and I just blend it out on my I'm gonna work it out more on the little thing that I did, blend it out more. Now, final step, lashes. This is the part that takes me kind of the longest. Sometimes my eyes not watch be on the nose. But, <clears throat> me progressing better on getting them to stay. So I got these lashes from off of Amazon. I'm going to put both the links for both pairs that I'll be using. So this is the other pair. Take the top off so I can see better. This is the other pair that I've been using as well. But I go through both. I'm just finally using the last one, the last show that I'm beginning. So I use hair glue. I don't use lash glue. I never have. Don't think I ever will give it a try because they're going to use the black glue. And I've been using this since the last one. Worst part of the year is that I got it. And I don't know what the person gave it to me. Y'all are the artists. Yeah, I do. Because I guess I probably do not have coke and take them too. Because I'm not going to sit there. You don't want me. It don't really matter which one it is. Just have to this one. And I just you know how I like it when you love me. I don't wanna stop for them to miss me. Yes, I see the things that they wish, you know. Well, that's good. Oh, I got some brothers that I live me. They gon' tell the story, shit was different with me. God's plan. God's plan. I hope that sometimes I won't. I feel good sometimes I don't want to do that. And then, what I've been doing recently is I was doing something in the end to help the glue kind of dry a little faster. So I had to be blowing on it myself. I don't be having that air resistance to that after that COVID. I stopped it. Really, it's just nothing much to it. I just stand there so I can get a little dark up to me. Because you'll be gray. Because one time I found that black girl that's when you have to find it. Right. Then I get to here to the back of me. Just to the back of me. Just to the back of me.
Talk to my favorite person because I love y'all, but this game for real. And I got at least 20,000 stuff now. So when I talk about them, talk about anything again. Because why not? But as y'all see, my makeup tutorial isn't really all that. Glitz and glam, really. It's quite simple. But I'm trying to catfish. I just try to enhance the natural beauty I got. So I'm gonna give it to you right now, like seriously right now, because you wouldn't believe seriously how least expensive this stuff is. Okay, so I got this from Ulta. It's Elf um, Lacrosse, and this is called Wild Rose. This is the name of it, Wild Rose, and this is three dollars. Then I have this little um, eyebrow pen, the same thing I use for my spoolie. Yeah, I use this part for my lip liner. And I got this from Found Below. Like probably like what three dollars max. I'm giving it max three dollars. So I like to go in with a little chapstick, brown liner, put down the line, your lips on dry skin, and you just be tracking and don't feel good. Do that. Do that. Pink. That's the only part that I leave my natural look for. 
I do the same thing on both sides. And then things. And I kind of aim that up like this. My top lip is already naturally lip lined. Natural off the color of my lips. So I have to do that much. I just. I'm in the corner. Okay. And then I'm gonna say I go in with the, the lip gloss. That's the um pink color and what I do is focus on the being in the middle because that's the part I want pink to be in pink right in the middle look at that this is before blending it out when I take it at the top I do all the parts that I didn't do at the top Now I just go like and just play with it to get the look you want. And that's that, you know. Mm -hmm. So that's really this whole video, you know. That's the look it's the look so that's really how i be getting that makeup look that natural looking makeup look that's how we get it i'm actually come over here so y'all can see better mm -hmm. i fit all this detox and then just chill out and vibe out but if you like this video and you enjoy it and you want some more tips about makeup or you have some tips for me give it to me because I'm still learning myself but I just learned how to perfect my natural little lip but yeah if y'all enjoyed it like and comment subscribe and goodbye ladies.